Erie County lawmakers have approved a new lease for the Buffalo Bills that some people have criticized for its large price tag. News 4's Rachel Kingston is live for you outside the Old County Hall tonight with more on this. Rachel? It's estimated that this agreement will cost Erie County and its taxpayers about $103 million over its 10 year life period. And right away, Erie County is going to have to borrow about $41 million to pay its share toward renovation of Ralph Wilson Stadium. However, today's vote was unanimous. All 11 county lawmakers signaling their support for the Buffalo Bills. The cost, they say, is worth it because of the money that the Bills bring into Western New York. You've got sales taxes on tickets, state income tax, and other economic benefits, including all of the people the bills employ. We've got $168 million plus of payroll right here in Erie County. Um, we've got millionaires living here, uh, uh, paying sales tax, buying homes, paying property tax. The bills are absolutely woven into the fabric of this Western New York community, and as such, we have to prioritize them for the next 10 years. The bottom line, the Buffalo Bills are staying in Buffalo. Now, the New York State Empire Development, Empire State Development Corporation and the NFL still need to sign off and approve the new bills lease before it becomes official, and it is expected that they both will do that. Reporting live outside Old County Hall, Rachel Kingston, News 4 at 6.